The postmortem examination performed by Dr. Nihal Singh gave the cause of death as asphyxiation due to a fractured larynx. In simple terms, it means that the taxi driver, 39-year-old Lal Bachan, Bachan, was suffocated due to a fractured voice box. Bachan, who was arrested on Friday for driving under the influence of alcohol, was found dead Monday morning. He was a father of four children. Today, his family held a protest exercise outside of the Saudi police station demanding that justice be served. They believe that officers attached to the station may be responsible for the man's death and are therefore calling for a thorough investigation into the matter. They clearly told us just now that there was no mark of violence on the deceased. Whereas I was there with other family members, his wife and everybody was there and viewed the body and there is, we have proof to show that there is mark of violence on the body. His face is swollen. His hand have bruises, his knees everywhere. And still, as up to now, we can't get no justice or no answer as to how he got that. The police came just now. They said that he could he, that happened because of a fall. I asked the question, how could someone possibly get a fractured lit, larynx. larynx by a simple fall? The answer that wasn't satisfactory because he said that he don't know about that of fall. It was just a, of a suspected fall. I don't think so. We are just asking for justice for him because I don't think that's that happened just like that. Something is not right in there. Probably because they didn't get the money because they wanted one hundred thousand dollars for him. So probably as they didn't get the money, they decided to do him that. But come on, we all are human beings. Why would someone kill him for one hundred thousand dollars? <laughs> that doesn't make sense. Or he was the only person in the cell. So who could have done that? He's not a crazy man for going to knock his head to a wall or if he would follow and understand the mark on his head very well. But how the throat, the throat have black and blue marks. What happened there? I want justice. I want to, I want to get justice for my husband and for my kids also. They're the victims mostly here because they will become, they, they're like, they don't have a father. So they're like fatherless. They don't know what to do. They would cry, yes. but. The small man, he doesn't really understand much, but this, the big one, he would cry most of the time. See, when he would see me crying, he would also cry. Say, Mama, don't cry, don't cry. I said, baby, well, what more I would do? I have nothing more to do but cry. I know I have to be strong for you, but I can do nothing much. But all I'm asking is for justice for my husband. Lisa Lowe Garnett, The Evening News.